We're here today to answer the number one most asked question we get about the ledge hog scissor jig, which is how do you rig a scissor jig? So we're gonna show you today, it's really simple. Um, what we have here, with the absence of that weed guard and these two hooks, a lot of people look at this and, the, and they're like, well, how am I gonna rig my bait on there so that it stays on, doesn't come off? It's super easy. All you do is when you take it out of the package, you're gonna open the hooks up horizontal just like that. You got a bait keeper right here in the center and it's a center pin screw lock so it makes it real easy to thread your bait on compared to those old hitchhikers and stuff that we used to use so you take your center pin and you find the center of your soft plastic and once you get it started in the center it's real easy just to thread that on here how far you go on this uh keeper is totally up to you Usually I just put my plastics on to the point where they're down to the bottom of the screw so that you can't see any more of the twists. Now you're going to find the horizontal point just like you would rig anything else so that you know your bait's nice and level on it. Okay, You're going to find where your hook comes through the bait. Mark that with your thumb and you just simply come like your Texas rigging around to about right here where my finger is. You're gonna close the two hook points until you get even with the shank of the hook that you just ran it up on. And then you're gonna just simply pull it right back up to the center, in the center of those two hooks. Now you've done two things right here. You've got it rigged on there nice and neat. It's real tight, they're not gonna pull it off, but here's a little tip. You can take and work your hooks a few times and extend in that little hole in the plastic to make it easier for the fish to bite down or you can leave it stiffer if, if you know you're on fish that are tearing up your soft plastic real fast and it's a real soft one just leave it like this don't don't adjust you know don't open and close the hooks and it'll be harder for the fish to mash down initially but it's still softer than a weed guard you're not gonna miss your fish so now even on a lake like here at Watts bar where there's a lot of grass you're not gonna have a problem of getting hung up in that grass. You can even overexpose the shank so that you're definitely not catching that grass. And right here you have a completely rigged swimming scissor jig, ready to go, totally weedless, still not gonna lose that catch of a lifetime. You're gonna get him on top and bottom jaw and you've caught that fish. This is available in five different sizes from an eighth ounce up to one ounce.